One of my earliest memories actually was uh, going around with my uncle in the summer months and, and going to visit the local farms and buying peppers and tomatoes and corn and uh, you could just feel the camaraderie. You could just feel that the, you know, there was definitely a connection there and, uh, and again I'm proud to say that that connection uh, is uh, with us today. It's part of the, it's part of the fabric that, uh, and, and part of the, you know, the, that connection with the community that we've had and part of the legacy that we've had. Having a, a fresh and local distribution center I think puts us in a position to really support our community, to support our local farmers, our local producers. And so it allows us to accommodate a whole variety of things, everything from uh, you know, Millie's pierogies to La Fiorentina, the, the, some of the bakery products, the cannolis are delicious by the way. To be able to accommodate that in, in one facility, not only having it fresh, but then being able to keep it fresh, be able to maintain it and, and deliver the, you know, that peak of freshness to our customers is what's important. And the other thing is that we're able to identify where it's coming from, the farms. And I think that's becoming more important to customers. So we don't just say it's local. We say it's from Meadowbrook Farms in East Long Meadow, or it's from Calabrese Farms in Aguam. Or, you know, again, it, it gives me a lot of pride and excitement uh, and, and obviously a continuing legacy to help incubate, if you will, these, uh, you know, these smaller businesses and, and help them to grow and help them to, to get uh, larger and become successful and uh, you know it's just a great partnership and it content it makes that connection with the community and I think that's so important it's been part of who we are from the very beginning and uh, you know we're, we're very very proud to be able to continue on that legacy